You are not supposed to limit him. You are supposed to magnify him. You are supposed to reference him. The best way of getting the best out of God is just to begin to praise him. Magnify the Lord with me. Let us exalt his name together. Remember what he has done before. Are you praising for what he has done, for what he is doing? And you have this faith that he's what God is not against you. Somebody say, God is not against me. God is for me. Hallelujah. Let me hear a shout, hallelujah. He is for me. He's working on my behalf. He has not forgotten me. He's working something out for me. God is able. More than able. Be disabled by your belief. Allow him to do what he wants to do. Allow him to your life, to all your life. Accept his word. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He came to his own. His own seek him not. John chapter 1 verse 11. He came to his own. His own received him not. In other words, they rejected him. If you are rejecting the word of God, God has been speaking to you, and you are not obeying his instruction, you are rejecting Jesus. If you are not walking in complete obedience, you are rejecting Jesus. If you are not obeying his commandment, you are rejecting Jesus. Say God forbid. Jesus, I accept you. If you refuse his word, you are rejecting him. If you refuse to obey him completely, you are rejecting him. If you say, well, I will pick uh, certain things in the word. I love, um, I love certain area of the word of God. I will just attach myself to that. The other areas I won't, I won't bother. Then you are rejecting Jesus. You can't pick and choose what you want to obey. You have to obey the whole concept of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You cannot pick and choose what you want to obey. Some people they will they will say there's a, there's a certain part in the scripture I don't want, I don't want. Then tear it out of the Bible. Then you will have an incomplete Bible. Then you have a disabled Bible. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are serving a complete God. A God that is able. A God that is more than able. But it's only disabled by you. It's only limited by you. We are serving an unlimited God. We are only limited by what you believe, them, by what you do, by what you want Him to do for you. Your obedience to God must be complete. You must walk in complete obedience before anointing can come, before power can come, before His work can become you know, real in your life. You must begin to walk in complete obedience. Hallelujah. In the book of Proverbs 2, two verse 1, Proverbs 2, verse 1, the Bible says, My son, I pray you receive my word. Don't reject it. Receive my commandment. In the book of Job 22, Job 22, verse 22, he said, I pray thee, receive instructions. Not silver, not gold. Receive my word. Whosoever receive the word of Jesus, receive Jesus. If you reject his word, you are rejecting Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is not enough for you to have head knowledge of the word of God. It is not just enough for you to quote scriptures. But those things that you are having the head knowledge of must be seen in your life. The epistle must become flesh in you. You must become someone who looks like Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you begin to obey the word of God, you are accepting the Lord. When, when they preach the word of God, you jump at it and you begin to walk in it. You are giving Jesus a warm reception into your heart. And you are a good soil. You are not a stony soil. Hallelujah. Somebody say, I'm a good soil. For the word of God, I'm a good soil. Your obedience must be complete. 
You don't just be quoting scriptures and the scripture you are quoting is not in your life. It can't be sin in your life, you are not obeying it. That is not the will of God. Your obedience will be complete, then the devil will submit himself to you. But your obedience is complete. The Bible says in the book of James chapter 4, verse 7. James chapter 4, verse 7. The Bible says, submit yourself unto God. Resist who? The devil. And you do what? If only you submit yourself unto the Lord. Somebody say, I will submit. In Jesus' name. Shall we rise up as we pray? Please close your eyes. I want to make an altar call. I want to make an altar call.